welcome you beautiful, lovely, gorgeous individuals out there, all you demigods out there, to a brand new reaction video here on my channel, Sam Macias. And on today's reaction, we're going to be reacting to Percy Jackson and the Olympias, episode 7 of season 1. We sort, we find out the truth, sort of. That is the title of the episode, and we are coming off the, off the heels and reins of last week's episode where they got, the team got to the Lotus Hotel, they got to meet Hermes, played by Lynn Manuel Miranda, and we're trying to figure out how to get from the Lotus to Santa Monica. That we're on this journey, we're trying to get to Santa Monica, because from there, you go to Hollywood, you go to hell, that's how you get to the underworld. Which I, I guess that's one way to look at Hollywood, if you really look and think about it. There was a, a lot of things happen at the Lotus Hotel. And it, one thing that I find very interesting is they it's a very, very unique thing. I worked for a hotel. I know exactly how it goes. They put the scent of the Lotus flower inside the aroma of the hotel. So as soon as you walk in, bam, they hit you with it. You don't have to eat the cookies. You don't have to eat the flower, but you're you're stuck inside of it. And they lost a lot of time. The team lost a lot of time. They need to make up a lot of that time right now. Sort of, kind of, but... As soon as Percy got to Santa Monica, he was going to meet his dad. His dad wasn't there, not because he didn't want to be, but it was too late for Percy. And now all Zeus and Poseidon, they're going to go at it. All on war is on. But Percy telling one of Poseidon's people, hey, I'm finishing this journey. We are ending it the way I want to end it. And they're going to find out who is the master thief who stole the bolt we're gonna we might find that out in today's episode also i want to let you guys know if you're looking for a after show podcast that talks about percy jackson goes in depth make sure to check out my friends katie and frankie the hosts of the shadow and wisdom podcast they do a great fantastic job analyzing going a deep dive of the Percy jackson series they are big fans of the book they know their ins and outs on everything and especially on the show so i can't wait to listen to their next episode i hope you guys give them a shout out from me because you know i help you out and with all that being said please make sure to hit that like button subscribe to my channel sam and Sears, for more fun videos like this one here and with all that being said let's get into it okay here we go we're still at, we should be still in santa monica right Oh, look, oh, oh, okay. It looks like a outdated mattress store. Welcome, weary traveler. Oh, oh. These beds will change your... Ooh, who are you now? Boy. Yeah, oh, I don't, I don't trust a man with that kind of hairstyle. Hello there. Or that kind of suit. Oh, my God, that's a bright green so, salute. Are we? I know who you are. Oh, who, who is it? Who is it? Oh. Son of Poseidon and murderer of travelers. Oh. His brother. His Please. brother, okay. And you. You've got dad's eyes. I think you'll feel much better. What are you trying to imply here, pal? You first. Oh, oh, smart. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Smart! Oh, they outthought him! There you go! That's using your brain, kids! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Back from the underworld, you won't be the first to fail! Hey! Shut up, pal! You're lucky we're letting you keep your head, dummy. Yeah, don't dummy. Push. It don't matter your family. Is it over? <laughs> Grover. I love you, Grove. Are we sure this is the right way? Ooh, okay. I wonder how I wonder what that flashback is gonna mean later on. There has to be a meaning to that flashback. Oh, so this is the underworld. Okay, yeah. I would want a vacation there. Not in Kansas. Yeah, not in Kansas. Hey, focus. We left Kansas four days ago. <laughs> she doesn't get the reference. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's beautiful. She doesn't get the reference. Grover, I know you're stressed, but but don't. Oh. Which means that over there is the main gate. Cross the river sticks, they go. Stop squeezing the damn ball. Please, yes, please. 
literally giving the, giving them away. I know you're stressed, Grove, but come on now. Come on now. Assess the situation. I mean, you don't want to give the guy all the money. You can buy a new whistle. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, you SOB. You slippery, slimy son of a gun. You called Cerberus. This is where Cerberus comes. Oh, there he is. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Yeah, you kids better run. That's a three headed dog monster. Oh my god, what the, what the hell? Oh no, okay, no, he's good. Okay, thank god. Oh my god, I thought, oh. Oh my god. I, I thought, I think that was him running away. Oh my god, that got me, that got me so bad. Oh. Oh. Okay, maybe, maybe. Oh, this episode, man. Oh, man, this episode. Okay. Breathe. Oh, the underworld it is not not a fun place. I'm learning that right now. Excuse me. Oh, she's she's a little petrified. Oh, smart. Come on, get get the ball, follow the ball. I gotta say the effects aren't that bad here. And it ain't half bad. Wow. Especially for Cerberus. That was really I mean, how did you Oh, what's happening now? What's happening now? Oh wow. I I don't feel good about this. His palace is upside down? That's supposed to be keeping the master boat. Hmm, interesting. And your mom. Oh no. Oh, what happened, Grover? What? My pearl. I lost the pearl. Oh, he lost the pearl. Grover. Oh, it's in Cerberus' mouth. Oh, that thing's already gone and digested. What are we gonna do? I don't know. If we don't move, it is not going to matter. Yeah, oh, boy. That, uh, that's for future problems, future Grover to think about. Right now, it's get to the palace. Get to Hades', Hades palace. No. No, 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 no. He, plus, plus your mom is four people. And only three pearls. Someone is staying behind. Yeah, I mean... It should really be me. It wasn't your fault. Grover you're is you're overthinking it, but he's not wrong. Oh. Get the and stop this war. You guys are leaving. I Percy, oh, he's putting everyone above himself. Is that Severus? Okay, hold on. Where did Annabeth go? Where did Annabeth go? Annabeth! Where'd she go? Oh, this ain't good. Annabeth! No, this ain't good. You never leave the company behind. Oh, no, she got caught. No. Oh, no way. They caught it caught her. No. Oh, no. What choice is weighing her down? What would you have to regret? What are you regretting? Oh, no, no, no. What are you regretting, Annabeth? Annabeth? Oh no! No! Oh my god! I swear to god, this episode. Your dad. You can do this. I know you can. I'm, I'm, what is Annabeth regretting? What is, what's anchor, anchoring her down into the roots? Oh my god. 
Oh, oh my God. No, no, no. What? Oh. She made it. Let's go. Oh, whoa. Did she get out? Did she? She gave the pearl to Percy, but how the heck did she get out? Oh, we're in Dunes. Welcome to Dune World. How much will they have to walk until they get to the, his palace? Hades' palace? Is that the Master Bolt? Is this? No. Looks like it absolutely it, is not. So it is the Master okay. Bolt. So what is it? Oh! Is, it it your is that what Annabeth was regretting? What did she? My bag. Did she plant that in there? This is the bag Ares gave. Oh, that's true. Ares had the Master Bolt this entire time and tricked us. He was working with Hades. So. That God of War, the God of Death, that makes sense. That was it. Right? That's the quest. I don't know. There has to be more to it than just that. He was expecting us to return this. He... Oh, but he needs to make a choice. Go to Zeus or save his mom. Oh, Ares, you, you little so-and-so. Zeus is just going to have to wait. There you, there you go. Yeah, you know what, Zeus? F you, Zeus. You need to calm your ass down. We need to save Percy's mom. Oh, uh, looks like we're at the gate, at the gates of hell. Even though we're already in hell, underworld. You know what I mean. Oh. Okay. It looks like you've been, you were expecting them, Hades, in a sense. I gotta say, this is a really good set design they got here. Hey, fellas. Welcome. Who are you? About all the... oh. Anyways, it's great to meet you. I know who you are and you know who I am, so we can just skip right past that part. You're not Hades. You anything. You're Hades? Pomegranate juice, a snack? Actually, my mother. You're Hades? Boom. I thought it was the other actor. Okay. Admire the cut of your jib. This is Hades. This way, don't be shy. I feel like this is a misdirect. Because we saw that other actor in the last episode. This can't be Hades. This isn't Hades. He seemed too squirmish to be. Hades managed to steal the bolt, trick me into bringing it right down and giving it to you. But it's wrong. Mm. And I won't do it. Percy is putting it together, well, calling them out. To the right thing, yeah, no, I don't. Hades won't do the right thing. He's going to do what's best for him. That's what Hades does. Huh? Yeah, see? What? Who, who tricked Ares into doing what? You're in cahoots with Ares. Oh, he's not working with Ares? I'm not in cahoots with Ares. I sell them cahoots. The bolt is my brother's drama. I don't want any part of it. Mmm. Oh. No. oh. What do you want? My helm. Your helm? That's what you want? What? My helm of darkness. It went missing just days before someone used it to turn invisible and steal the bolt. I'd like it back now, please, and then you get your mom back. Whoa, okay. This is a curveball here. Start a war between your brothers. Kronos? Excuse me? No. the longest grudge of them all. Zeus took Kronos' throne. Who else has a bigger reason to weaken Zeus and take his throne? Back? Hold on, hold on. Kronos isn't a million pieces of democracy. This changes the game. Where something just tried to pull us into the moment. Holy of crap, we're going with Kronos. The Kronos? Where I've been hearing a voice from in my dreams telling me it needs my help to take down Olympus. Oh, I damn. You, but that voice I heard, that definitely did not sound like you. I was, I was literally saying that. Mm. Oh. This changes the game for you, doesn't it? I accept your offer. Great, your okay. first offer. We're gonna go get your help. And when I get back, you're gonna let my mom go. Okay, hang on, kid. Go for it now. Oh. Hold fast, mom. Um. 
okay, so we need to find his helm. Where are we going to find his helm at? Is that what Ares had? Is, is that what Ares got? Oh, man, this ep this episode is throwing us all for a loop. I mean, I really want to believe you, Poseidon. I really do. His mother raised him well. She, she did. She damn well did. She's trying so hard to keep it together. Do you want to talk to him? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay, now we get the the meaning behind these flashbacks. Oh, what are you gonna do, Poseidon? One day. Oh, come on, come on, Poseidon. One day when he's ready. Oh, are we gonna get it? Are we gonna see him talk to him? When he knows who he is. There's Annabeth. Okay, she got it all right and safe. Oh, this is oh, this is a really good shot. Oh, there's Ares. You slimy sob. Adam Copeland, you son of a gun. Matt freaking Hardy, Matt Adam Copeland. How about that? Oh, oh my God. Okay, so we're getting this was such an intense episode. God, this was so good. This was so good. Oh, man, I can't. I can't believe this is the penultimate episode before next week's season finale. Series finale season? I hope it's a season because we need more of this show. This show was so good. So that was episode seven of Percy Jackson and Olympians. Man, okay. This episode had a lot of twists and turns. The jump scares alone, wow. That got me a few times in this episode, let me tell you. And it, it really, it's really interesting because that threw us for a loop. We all thought that one actor we saw in the last episode talking about stealing the boat, doing all the plants, talking to Percy in his head. We all thought that was Hades. We all thought and assumed that was Hades from the jump. And then this guy just comes up and is like, hello, hi. Like, a complete 180. Complete 180. I, and I said it from the jump in the reaction. You're not Hades. I feel like this is a swerve. I, I, you guys, you're tricking us, right? This is a misdirect. No, it wasn't. That guy was Hades. And the other actor is Kronos, one of the biggest big bads in Greek mythology of all time. You, they're setting up for a seat. That's, that's season two, season three setup. Because Kronos, he's like Fire Lord Ozai in the Avatar last time. He's the big, he's a big bad. Oh my God, that, and that's clever, right? Again, I gotta say for this show, the writing is on point because they could have obviously do the, the simple route and they didn't, they're going, they're going the other route. So you gotta wonder, you gotta wonder now who was Kronos talking to before addressing Percy? I'm, I'm assuming whoever he was talking to, that was the one who stole the bolt. I don't think now I don't think Ares knew who stole the boat. I think he, he gave him the bag, probably assuming whatever that was in there was going to help him. But I didn't think he knew the boat was in there. And he probably found out that he, he was getting the, the his name dragged through the mud as the lightning thief. Oh, my God, man, this uh, this this was a good episode. This was such a good episode. I can't wait for next week. I think it's a season finale. I think there was only eight episodes. So this was a penultimate. Next week's a season finale. I can't wait to watch it. Uh, let me know in the comments down below. What did you guys think of the episode? Did you have fun? What are some of your theories? Were you expecting Kronos to show up this early? Let me know in the comments down below. If you want to follow me on all my social medias, please do so. All my handles in the description for you as well. And as always, you beautiful, lovely, gorgeous demigods out there, make sure you hit like, subscribe to my channel, Sam Macias, for more fun reactions like this one here. And until next time, bye!